Hey guys, welcome to my video. So, turns out I'm a liar. There will be actually a third part because I didn't realize how long this video would be. But I hope you enjoy. I was not going to uni today because I think it's been known that this week has been quite overwhelming. I don't know, I think yesterday was kind of a big wake up call in terms of how I'm coping mentally and my health. Yesterday being at uni, I felt like I just wanted to work on the show, which we didn't really get to do because we were figuring out the um, administration and how everything would work, like the actual show wing overall like like we had the tickets released yesterday we picked out the the name which by the way it's called the inventory i think it's okay now to put in like this is the poster without the qr code but this is the poster no i was just getting frustrated and i feel like being at uni doing normal class i wouldn't even be able to enjoy it because i'm too busy fo thinking about this show i think the main thing is the fact that i feel like i don't really have substance for my show so what I've done is I've written down my goals, so make flowers. Next I have make the dialogue, so there's substance in terms of content. Make soundscapes, so I have something that feels like it will definitely change the environment. And those are my four main things today. In the meantime, there's been a lot of lows. Let's bring up to a high. So big wins is, as we saw, I got fake grass. I have a show name, so I called it The Abyss. And... I wrote my first art artist bio. I'm gonna read you guys my artist bio. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I have an artist bio. Francine Miranda is a Filipino Australian theater maker with a huge fascination in the realm of dream core, alternate realities, and surrealism to explore the depths of the human experience using both dance led movement, visual art, music, and architecture to influence her work. And then I have the show bio, which is this is the abyss, a place that seems familiar that you've never been there before. Maybe the entity could show you. Be ready to open your mind. I did that. I can't believe I did it. That was probably one of the most intimidating things. And it's, I think it was intimidating because it feels like the first time I'm marketing myself and how I'm choosing to outwardly show who I am as an artist. <laughs> I'm so happy I just finished a monologue. Okay, I was looking through my old writing intensive notes that I did in a writing intensive class like the week before we started the show and there was like some writing in there that would be really useful so I just put it in here. For the sake of tomorrow's pitch, it will just be that but I will definitely fix it. Although I shouldn't do that because I have to memorize it but that's okay, that's so okay, that's so fine. I have a monologue, I have my first monologue. So update. I am making the soundscape and that means I have to time my monologues if I do talk. Um, but we are at almost 3 minutes out of 5 and we are in the middle part. No, we're not even in the middle part. We are- so there's 5. We have 1, 2, we just finished 2 and we have 2 more minutes left to spare. <laughs> I'm 
writing my show. There is no show. I keep looking at the script and there's no show. Look at this. Nothing. Nothing. It's not even focusing. I think you understand how severely anxious I am about this presentation. Like, if they, I really don't want to present anything today because I have nothing to show. Um, nor am I proud of it and I'm just not ready. Like, anyway, I've got these fake flowers. I'm gonna just chuck them. Oh, I can't be blocked. No, it's okay. Yes. <laughs> Put this on. Can I do it after feeling? Yeah. Look at my hair. Hey, hair. I could have lost it. Can you see this hair? Can I do it? No, no, it's an echo effect. There's been like a huge echo effect. Whoa. Three verbs. Three verbs. Three verbs. <laughs> if you want, you can have auto pitch. Janky setup. I just have this laptop and my <laughs> broken mic. Well, my hope is everyone is in class. Usually, people in this building have like the same schedule, so no one should be coming in. I need to get my text, figure out what I'm recording. So, I've got 15 minutes till I have to leave the house, but today is actually headshot photos. So. I finished the audio and all I have to do now is do the projections and then memorize my lines and then figure out my movement piece. But we did it! Okay guys, it is 2am and I need to pack for tomorrow. But let me show you what I have. I have a little roller bag which has the projector and I'm gonna bring a big sports bag with my clothes, makeup, tech stuff and I hope it's all I'll need. Tomorrow, I'm so scared because bumping is happening. But yeah, I usually don't stay up to 2 a.m. But I was talking to my friends. 